Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. You have the Rhino, you have Colgate, we have this here beer. This is, oh, oh, the label's all ripping apart. Look at this. Jesus. This is El Diablo from a micro brasserie de livre. What does that translate to, by the way? <laughs> Microbrewery a book. Microbrewery the book. Something about a library, perhaps. <laughs> Children's no, that's a bibliotheque. Oh, you're right. Oh. <laughs> what happened? Nothing. It's C H E H goodness. Oh yeah, the real Canadian beer festival. <laughs> <laughs> Piss me off. Yeah, beer market. It was fun stealing all these glasses from a innocent gun tasting. Hmm. Now, if I know anything about Spanish, El Diablo means the double. So I'm expecting a Spanish Belgian double. El Diablo means the devil. <laughs> yeah, <I know. laughs> That's a bit of humor for you folks out there. Oh, no, no, you're just dumb. Oh. That's what the folks out there will say. It's what Guy told me, okay? Guy, Guy told, gave us this beer. Don't trust anyone from downtown Ottawa, Canada. From downtown Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. Wow, that is red. Like the devil red. Yeah, it's a nice color though. It's pretty nice. Nice for the devil. Head. Ooh. It smells like sins. Yeah. Butterscotch is sins. Blasphemy. <laughs> Butterscotch toffee. It does smell really good. It smells like a Werther's original. I was just gonna say that. Because <laughs> of all the old people and the butterscotch Hell candies. Hell yeah, they love them the butterscotch candies. <laughs> now, Untapped says this is an American barley wine. With the smell, I would think English barley wine, though. English barley wines come off more and more toffee. with the toffee-ish and butterscotch scents, where the American barley wines are a lot more hopped. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Definitely more smell toffee, the bottle. I think. That is super sweet out of the bottle. Mm-hmm. Let's try this. Yeah, I'm excited now. Ooh. Wow. Super sweet. It's like liquid candy. Liquid Werther's original. <laughs> this is pretty much like Liquid Werther's. I'm okay with that. Mm. Vanilla, butterscotch, toffee. Uh, a dirty, somewhat earthy, hot backbone. So still reminding me more of an English barley wine. Uh, tiny, tiny, tiniest touch of, of alcohol. Right at the bottom of the throat though, like mm -hmm. right near the stomach, not mm -hmm. in the back of the throat or anything, for me at least. And at 10% alcohol, that makes it a very, very dangerous beer. It is dangerous. It doesn't taste like any sort of fruit candy, Gee, but is little thin. every sort of... <laughs> hey Paul, little thin? Um, every sort of English candy for sure, like this is ridiculous. Yeah. Huh. I was not expecting this from label at all. This is fantastic. Kind of has a weird, slightly smoky, tangy taste on the background. I'd almost think chipotle peppers, but I'm pretty sure there isn't in this. I can't speak fluent French though, so I wouldn't be able to. Then I ripped most of the label. You dummied it. I dummied it. I did. Um, but yeah, it just has that kind of weird warming, like tingling warming to me in the background. I can see that. Mostly toffee for me, a little bit of hidden alcohol, because it doesn't come off as 10% at all. Again, Gajaru, Guy. But, this is fucking great. I love this, this is great. Definitely nice to share. Yep. And it's a big 750. It was, it was, I think it was 12 bucks. Yeah, 12 bucks for the no 750. No complaints. Um, Share something like this. 
maybe maybe a complaint to buy it just to drink on your own, but to buy it to bring to a dinner party or something to put it on the table instead of a bottle of wine, perfectly fine. Same ABV, same price. Mm -hmm. And I'd enjoy this more. Yeah, another kind of nice dessert ish beer. Yeah, out of ten because of the sweetness. I'm gonna give like an eight and a half. I want. I almost want to give it a little bit more, but I just. I don't know how many people I could buy this, and share it with. You know, like I have a limited selection of friends that would actually appreciate it as a dessert beer too. I think you just have a limited selection of friends. <laughs> oh. Is this happening on camera? <laughs> <laughs> I'm a loner, your so. Yeah, it's, I'm, I'm going to drink it with myself, or I'm going to drink it with myself. Um, His brother I don't, or your mom. Yeah, that's it. In our underpants. Uh, <laughs> reference earlier videos for that. <laughs> uh, eight five from you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, eight five from both of us. Um, eight point two five. No, oh, you just want to be different, man. Hell yeah. <laughs> nice dessert beer, though, for sure. Thank you very much, Dee. Thanks, guy. Thanks, Frenchie.